This question is to use of integration by parts. Evaluate the definite integral of the product of the expression t times the quantity 4 plus t and the cosine of 3t with respect to t. First step is to expand the expression. Before starting the integration process, we expand the product. Multiplying t by the quantity 4 plus t gives us 4t plus t squared. So now we are integrating the product of the expression 4t plus t squared and cosine of 3t. Next step is to use of integration by parts. Let's choose u to be the expression 4t plus t squared. Then the derivative of u, which we'll call do, becomes 4 plus 2t. Let's now choose dv to be the differential part, which is cosine of 3t with respect to t. Integrating this, we get v equals 1 third times sine of 3t. Now applying the integration by parts formula, which says the integral of u dv equals u times v minus the integral of v do. We get the following, 1 third times the expression 4t plus t squared multiplied by sine of 3t, minus the integral of 1 third times the expression 4 plus 2t multiplied by sine of 3t. Next step, we deal with the second integral, the integral of the expression 4 plus 2t times sine of 3t. We again use integration by parts. Let's set u as the expression 4 plus 2t, then do its derivative is 2. Let dv be sine of 3t with respect to t. Integrating this, we get v equals negative one-third times cosine of 3t. Now applying the integration by parts formula again, we get negative one-third times the expression 4 plus 2t times cosine of 3t, plus the integral of 2 over 3 times cosine of 3t. The remaining integral is straightforward. The integral of cosine of 3t is one-third times sine of 3t. So the whole term becomes 2 over 9 times sine of 3t. Putting it all together, the second integration gives us negative one-third times the expression 4 plus 2t times cosine of 3t, plus 2 over 9 times sine of 3t. Next step is to assemble the final answer. We now substitute everything back into our original expression. We had the first term, one-third times 4t plus t squared times sine of 3t. Now subtracting the second result, which includes two terms. First, negative one-third times the expression 4 plus 2t times cosine of 3t. Second, plus 2 over 9 times sine of 3t. Subtracting this full expression is equivalent to adding the first term and subtracting the second one because of the negative sign in front of the integral. So we get 1 third times 4t plus t squared times sine of 3t plus 1 over 9 times the expression 4 plus 2t times cosine of 3t minus 2 over 27 times sine of 3t. And don't forget to add the constant of integration at the end. That's it for this question. This video is based on our math tutoring blog and class recordings. Hope you enjoyed it. Please subscribe to our channel. If you're looking for tutoring on final exam level questions, check out my YouTube channel at MathTutor8285. You'll find helpful explanations and strategies to ace your exams.